Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys, peep game. All right, so I'm pretty sure some of y'all will see this this picture. If not, here here you go right here. And here's more of an implication of what type of person that Sierra is. Here she is taking a picture with Megan Thee Stallion, with Megan Thee Stallion having her hands on her, on her butt. Now, keep in mind, this happened on a Sunday. And in particular, didn't she say she had went to church? Hmm, interesting. But so she goes from church to worst. And at the end of the day, taking a picture like this with Megan Thee Stallion. And then at the end of the day, uh, you have women that try to justify her behavior. But at the end of the day, a lot of y'all women is, is gutless. You try to justify everything instead of taking accountability and just saying, hey, this is not cool. And it's not cool. Imagine if it was the other way around. If Russell Wilson was taking pictures with his, you know, head by a woman's breasts or his head by a woman's big butt or something. Y'all have a fit saying he he disrespectful and he need to respect his wife. But yet y'all don't call the wife out for disrespecting her husband. And of course, Megan Thee Stallion in the middle of something. She seems to like being in the middle of something, just like she got in the middle of Tory Lanez and her best friend, Chelsea, who she introduced Tory Lanez to and basically all of a sudden started back doing her her own best friend with the dude that she told her to mess with and then went on the stand and lied, which she lied several times on the stands about her not having an affair with Tory Lanez. Megan Thee Stallion is not a good person. And this picture further proof that she isn't. Why would you take a picture like that for everybody to see with your hand on somebody's butt? That's just real talk. I wonder how, I wonder how would she feel if she was married and then some lady, you know what I'm saying, that's supposed to be her, her home girl, sat up there and took a picture with her hand on, you know, on the dude's crotch. Would that be cool? Would y'all women be okay with that? No. But that's what I'm saying. A lot of y'all just try to justify this type of behavior, skate behavior, thought pocket. Megan Thee Stallion and Sierra is acting like thought pockets. And that's real talk. Don't come on here telling me why am I worried about it? Because I know somebody going to eventually say that. Well, if that's the case, why are you worried about what I'm talking about? I mean, come on, man. Is there any type of type of respect or dignity? That's that's just real talk. This comes into the whole thing of, you know, nice guys finish last. The whole thug thing. The whole, you know what I'm saying? Nice guys are boring and all this kind of stuff. She prayed for this dude. And it seems to me she got blessed with him. But then look how she treating him. Russell Wilson wasn't raised in the streets. That dude ain't going to sit up there and like call her out on social media and say, well, why ain't Russell Wilson saying say anything? You know why? Because if he says something, he'll be vilified. And then you'll have these fake feminist groups saying he picking on the woman. He's body shaming her and all that baloney. Because that's exactly what it is. Pure D baloney. No accountability whatsoever. I mean, for real, can y'all just stop the cap? Is it? I mean, Sierra just further showing who she is and what type of person she is. At the end of the day, like I said before... I mean, Sierra, if you want to make songs about being independent and single, then let, let Russell Wilson go. Let him end up with a, a more respectful black woman who will treat him the way he should be treated. Step aside. Let him know for real, Sierra. Step aside and let a, respect, a more respectable black woman have him. Because like I said, when eventually he get tired of this and divorce Sierra and then his next wife or next girlfriend is a non-black I don't want to hear this stuff about black dudes always mess with women that's not from their community. Well, look how he's being treated and disrespected. Could we please stop this BS? And like, like I said before, Megan Thee Stallion is everything that people think about her. And like I said before, I didn't feel one bit sorry for her. And she proven why you shouldn't feel sorry for her. Here she is involved in, in, in the mix of something. Seems to me like Megan the Stallion like being a sandwich. For real talk. And a cheap one at that. That's real talk. But anyway, this is all you need to know about Sierra and Megan the Stallion. They from the streets. But then again, Megan the Stallion warned us. She did say she was ratchet. So she is who she says she is. 
This your boy TLBS. I'm out.